Well done if you said our sound was ng. And here it is, our sound of the day. Ng. My turn. Ng. Your turn. My turn. Ng. Your turn. Ng. Ng. Excellent. It's another special friend for us to learn. And it's made of two letters. Our special friend has an N and a G. Together, they make the sound ng. Can you say it to the ceiling? Ng. Can you say it to the floor? Ng. Can you say it to the window? Ng. Excellent. Ng. And if you heard it in the words that we said earlier, well done, because ng is in the word string. Is it at the beginning of that word, in the middle of that word, or at the end of the word? String. It is, it's at the end of the word. String. At the end, string. Excellent. What about sing? We had our boy who was singing. What about the word sing? Does it have the sound ng in it? Sing. It does. It has it at the end of the word again. Like string and sing, they both have ng at the end of those words. Ng. And that's why they sound very similar. String, sing, song, again, it's at the end of the word, song, ng, at the end, song. Can you hear ng in the word ring? Excellent, it's at the end of the word again, ng, r, i, ng. Ring, s, i, ng, sing, s, o, ng, song. Well done. And our ring had some bl, i, ng, bling, bling, ring, song, sing, and string. All have our sound ng at the end of those words. So well done if you spotted that. So what we're going to do now is use ng to make some words. Okay, so that we know that ng usually goes at the end of the words. The pictures told us that, didn't it? So ng, when we're thinking about words to make with ng, think about if that word has ng at the end because it should have it at the end the first word we're going to make is bang 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 what which sounds can you hear in the word bang b a ng bang can you hear three sounds because i can b Ng, bang. What's our first sound for bang? B, a, ng. Have a look. See if you can spot it. There it is. B. That's our first sound. What's our middle sound? B. Ah. Excellent. B. Ah. There is our sound, ah. We'll put it in the middle. And we already know that ng is going to go at the end. We know that. So let's sound it out. B, ah, ng. B, ah, ng. Bang. B, ah, ng. Bang. Excellent. Right, our next word is ring. Ring. 
ring. How many sounds can you hear in the word ring? R, e, ng. Can you hear three sounds? I can too. Well done. R, e, ng. What's the first sound in that word? Have a look for it on our board. It is. It's r. 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 I. Can you spot I for me? Well done. R. I. Ng. Where is Ng? Is this special friend Ng? No. Is this special friend Ng? It is. Well done. And that's going to go at the end of our word. Let's read our word by sounding it out. Are you ready? As I point, say the sound. R. I. Ng. R. I. Ng. R. Ing. R. Ing. Ring. Excellent reading reception. You know that our special friend ng is still at the end of the word. I think ng likes it at the end of words, doesn't he? R e ng ring. We're going to make one more word, and this word is going to have two special friends in it, and the word is thing, thing. Thing. How many sounds can you hear in the word thing? A thing on a string. Thing. I. Ng. I. Ng. Can you hear three sounds too? Show your eyes three fingers and press those sounds on. I. Ng. Thing. What's the first sound? Thing. Thing. There we go. That's first sound is th. Th. I is our middle sound. Where is I? Can you point to it? Excellent. There it is. Th. I. Ng. Our special friend at the end again. Let's read the word to make sure we built it right. I ng I ng thing. Excellent reception. You just made a word with two special friends. Th and ng thing.